goalkeepers, our review is the Royce Friegel Gold X Finger Support. The reason why we brought the Gold X Finger Support in is because it is a high-end game goalkeeper glove with finger protection, but you're at a $140 price point right now. You know, you can find a lot of options below $100, but you're going to sacrifice certain technology. And we know Roish is the best in finger protection. They're always looking for ways to test and upgrade their finger protection. What I love about the finger support system, it's less expensive than the Orthotech, but what you get is flexibility going forward. It's lightweight, but yet you get the same protection going back. Orthotech, a little bit more expensive, patented, been um, proven to reduce finger protection injuries. And I'll say the same, that finger support also is gonna do the same for those goalkeepers that require additional support and protection. It's available in the fingers as well as the thumb, right? The thumb is the hardest protect, but they put it in the thumb. Feels really comfortable. I don't feel in the backhand. It's not removable in the backhand, which is important to know. That's a big difference between the Orthotech and the finger support models. It features a Roish Grip X all-weather game latex for those advanced goalkeepers. And there's a difference. Gold X is a different latex altogether than the Roish Grip Gold latex. The Roish Gold X latex is going to give you a little bit more durability. So, you know, you can be a high-end goalkeeper but have a little bit more durability, say you play in turf. Still a game latex, still an all-weather latex, but the Gold X latex is a step down, but still an amazing uh, latex in the Roish range. Another great feature of that Royce Gold X is that you have the segmented palm and that gives you an uh, ergonomic fit and feel. So sometimes when a goalkeeper flexes their fingers or the palm, you get bunching. And so that ergonomic, that flex zones in the palm and the fingers, they reduce some of that bunching that makes the glove, you know, feel a little bit bigger or create spaces. So definitely helps with that support in the catching process. And you also have a slight DuraGuard patch on the bottom and that reduces the wear of a vulnerable area of the latex when you put your hand down. You know, if you have any questions on the finger support, we're happy to help the differences you know, I'm not a finger protection guy, but that's a personal choice, that's up to you. You can use finger protection if you need some more support and protection because you're recovering from an injury. You can use finger protection because you're playing up in age or you're learning the technique. I mean, there are pros that use finger protection, so that's a personal choice. That's my goalkeeper PSA. Use finger protection if that's what you want to use. The color zone um, is from last year's colorway from the World Cup. You have this desert green, World Cup 2022, this backhand, you know, you have an air vent system inside which promotes optimal airflow throughout the base material. You also have a, a great four-way stretch material um, that's underneath the free gel. And that's what's important here on the name of the glove is the free gel. The free gel is that, that rubberized punch zones in the back, the rubberized design, and it just gives a little bit more structure to the glove while still giving you the flexibility. So that's what really free gel is. You know, it's this, you know, treatments of the rubberized areas in the backhand that are that are um, glued and heat pressed on. The cut is an evolution negative cut. And what you get there is the negative cut reduces all of the extra material. It's stitched inside. The latex gussets are perforated, so you're going to have a lot of airflow. But it's a contactless, you don't feel the stitching inside, which is very important. The fingertips, that evolution negative cut, is a roll fingertip. And you get a lot of latex ball contact, especially you can see it in the finger protection models because the fingertip pads are a little bit bigger. So no matter which way the ball twists and turns the latex, even on the thumb side, you have a wrap on the thumb side. So you have a lot of latex of all contact while reducing a lot of extra room, which is important when you have finger protection inside the goalkeeper gloves. And this is gonna lend to the overall fit and feel because there's not a lot of extra room on the sides or the palms. There's not a lot of extra material, which is important. This is a well-designed glove. And at a budget of $140, it might be uh, rich for some, but there's a lot of technology in this glove and it is a lot less expensive than the higher end, really high end advanced pro versions of the Orthotech models. 
The closure, you know, you have a nice uh, elasticated cotton wrist opening um, and you can slide it on, on, and on, on and off with ease. What I like about it is the pull loop. You can pull the, the glove on and off. And what helps is it, it helps goalkeepers not damage the glove as they pull it on and off. So you pull your glove on because you don't want to damage the latex. And I can pull down on that pull loop, be patient, work my fingers in and I wrap around and I'm good. So the Royce Free Gel Gold X finger support, it fits true to size, I'm wearing a size nine. It's available in sizes seven through 11. If you have any questions on the, the fit and the feel of the Royce Free Gel Gold X finger support, the review, or if you have any questions on Royce Goalkeeper glove sizing, we're here at keeperstop.com to answer any questions. Let us know your comments below. Happy to help in any way to make sure that you're saving more on the field as well as in your wallet. Thanks for watching.